Right now let's talk about the power plant, the motor and uh, the prop combo that I'm using on this plane. Now I'm using a uh, NTM series. There you go. 3542 uh, prop drive, which I got from uh, Hobby King. Uh, I've used uh, different size motors, all NTM series, uh, on my uh, smaller ones, on my Bixlers when I was uh, using Bixlers back then. And uh, you know, I'm, I'm happy with the, the performance and the reliability. Actually, I used a 1800 kV on a Bixler that crashed and uh, and it, it crashed big time and the, the motor is still so good. So anyways, this is swinging a 12 by 6 uh, prop which I got from a local hobby store here. And again, the prop mount from this small part CNC. I used uh, different motors here and I'll show it to you guys. I used a Turnigy Aero Drive 35, 36, 10, 50, and uh, I paired that with a nine by six air screw. It was okay. It was a uh, I, I have the speed that I that I need, but it's not quite as efficient as I want it to be. Because if I'm going to fly long range, and I I, I used uh, this was used on a 3S setup, so yeah and i just want to uh point out one thing here if you notice this adapter that came with the motor be careful when you are screwing those uh bolts in they are not as strong as uh, you think they are and two of them snapped and i said you know what this is brand new i can't use it so i just i, epo I used epo ep epoxy metal epoxy to uh, blue epoxy them together and it wasn't good there's a bit of vibe actually there's quite some vibration when I was using this uh, I also tried swinging uh, using this motor uh, 35 36 10 50 kV a 10 by 6 air screw it was okay but uh, again, the efficiency that I was looking for wasn't there, and again, it was on a 3S. Now, I have a spare motor, a backup motor, it's also a 30G aero drive, which I will install in uh, a few weeks or so. There you go, sorry, can't focus. This is a quite big, uh, a bit bigger than a 35, uh, 36, it's a 3542, 1000 kV. Pretty much the same, I don't know, the same KV as the NTM series. So I'm gonna install this uh, a few weeks from now. And also 4S, I'll be swinging this same prop, 12 by six, because I really, really like the efficiency of this uh, propeller and motor combo. And this also comes with a prop adapter, uh, Yama. Probably gonna ask, can you change the? I guess if you notice, it's a it's an outrunner, so this big thing spins. Some would like to reverse it, and I think you know, I just need to remove that lock over there. I never, never did try that. I always mounted it this way. So comes with a box, all the screws, and another set of adapter. So, anyways, that's the power plant of this. Uh, Skywalker, oh sorry, Skywalker setup, and uh, I'm gonna stick with this until you know I find it necessary, maybe to get a lower KV prop, maybe from uh, FPV uh, model or uh, Bev RC. Okay, video system again. I think I mentioned on uh, already. I'm using a 600 TVL camera. This is a servo I got from uh, FPV uh, model it's a uh, metal gear and it's uh, a 180 degree servo so that's the one uh, I don't use it that much but you know if you're doing long distance and you get bored usually you know, try it so I'm using another channel uh, just for that 
moving on to the wing, this is my the 100, one sorry, 1.3 gigahertz. I uh, used to fly 5.8. I just installed this and so far so good. I'm pretty happy. It's I think an 800 milliwatt uh, transmitter wire here and uh, goes there. Plugs onto one of the you know mods that I did. Just to plug it here. This goes straight to the AV out of the OSD. Again, this was uh, purchased at uh, Radio. Sorry. FPV model, yeah, 1.3 gigahertz. Now I also got a low pass filter for 1.3. This one, if you can see there, I kind of hot glued it in. There you go. It's a low pass filter I got from Redmade RC. I got this when I got my Blue Beam Ultra antennas. I'd be crazy. So this is the one that I'm using to go on to that and this one goes to my ground station so nothing really fancy on my video system there I use a popular 808 number 16 camera uh, I used to have a Mobius but you know I, I lost the plane and the Mobius was uh, in there I uh, have an SG4000 coming in so I might replace that but for now that one works fine there you go.